Dobra, więc witam serdecznie w kolejnym znakomitym odcinku z serii Genshin Impact. No i może pamiętacie, ostatnio właśnie został dodany ten cały patch 2.7. No i teraz wykonujemy właśnie tę misję z tego aktu drugiego z tych ogromnych dungeonów, tego czazm tak zwanego. No i ostatnio trafiliśmy przed oblicza takiego oto wielkiego portalu. No i zobaczymy na czym to będzie tym razem polegało. Ej, zaraz, zaraz, przepraszam, pod F, nie wiem, co ja w ogóle wy wytworzyłem. E, czyli tak, 71 poziom, raczej powinniśmy dać radę. Czyli to będzie przejście na jakiś tajemniczy dungeon, zapewne z dużą ilością walki. W sumie nawet bez żadnej fabuły, tak na samym wstępie. W poprzednim materiale było bardzo dużo właśnie takiej fabuły przed rozgrywką. This is actually pretty cool. If we weren't in such a hurry to get out, we could kick back and enjoy the scenery a little. No, bra, więc mamy od razu pierwszych wrogów. No, dobra, czyli trzeba będzie obracać właśnie takimi dziwnymi. Sam w sumie nie wiem, jak to nazwać, platformami. Czy z jednej strony zajdziemy trochę walki, z drugiej nie wiem, elementy logiczne. No i zobaczymy, na czym to będzie później polegało. No to nie są jacyś super mocni wrogowie. No i po raz kolejny możemy obracać. Może jakiś adeptus nowego rodzaju, którego jeszcze nie znamy do końca. No na samym wstępie mamy po prostu samą walkę, więc zobaczmy. Jeszcze tutaj ulta odpalimy. No to nie są wrogowie jakiejś, jakiegoś wielkiego kalibru. Z takimi radziliśmy sobie już wielokrotnie. Jeszcze ktoś, jeszcze jakiś pojedynczy. No co mi to w ogóle było? Nie, to chyba jakaś w ogóle poboczna sprawa. A nie, przepraszam, jeżeli teraz to obrócimy... Ta, to niektóre platformy mogą się w wielu płaszczyznach jeszcze obracać. No ciekawa misja, trzeba przyznać. Dungeon dosyć unikalny. Tędy do obrady jeszcze jakkolwiek przejść, ale niestety mamy blokadę. Więc nie tak prosto. Coś trzeba jeszcze wykonać innego, ale... W sumie nie widzę obecnie żadnego rozwiązania. Ciekawa sprawa. Tędy już nie mogę przejść, niestety. Ukrytych przejść raczej nie uświadczymy. Tędy natomiast mamy do czynienia z jakimiś lampionami, ale... Nie, to nam dużo nie zagwarantuje. Nie da rady. Dobra, wydaje mi się, że kilka razy do obrady jeszcze obrócić tą platformę, więc zobaczmy, co z tego wyjdzie. Nie, to nam też dużo nie zagwarantuje. Jeszcze raz, rotate. Takie rozwiązanie jest już całkiem możliwe. Albo i nie. Nie, możemy się wrócić w sumie na sam początek. Dobra, może coś z tego zaraz... ...zadziała. A nie, patrzcie na to, jeszcze wracamy się na jakieś zupełnie nowe rejony. Jeżeli mnie pamięć nie myli, no to na tej platformie nas w sumie jeszcze chyba nie było, a może byliśmy na samym wstępie? Może się jednak w tym trochę zgubić. Nie wiem dlaczego tamta właśnie platforma jest nieczynna. Na czym to może teraz polegać? No i dobra, jednak daliśmy radę, no i po raz kolejny walka na nowych wrogów. No i po raz kolejny nie jest to nic super nadzwyczajne. No kto wie co będzie później? Może jakaś walka z bossem na samo zakończenie? No jeszcze kolejna fala, proszę bardzo, nie tak prosto. No to i tak mam kontrę na takich wrogów, ataki wodniste oraz zimowe. No i sprawa załatwiona. Ta, i nareszcie przechodzimy na jakieś zupełnie nowe rejony, z tym razem. O! Jest i walka na dwóch bossów jednocześnie, jak sobie na takich radzić. 
Z kolei jacyś ci bardziej skalni, ale ten Diluk chyba ma całkiem dobre obrażenia na nich, jeżeli dobrze pamiętam. Te bronie ciężkiego kalibru sobie na nich dobrze radziły. Jeszcze możemy się zawsze uleczyć. Mind the trzeba przyznać, że na ekranie dzieje się jednak całkiem sporo. Kurde, co mi za kombo wyjechali. Czasami można się w tej rozgrywce jednak totalnie zgubić. Dobra, jednego mamy z głowy. Kurde, jak ja nagle totalnie obrywam od nich. To nie są jednak prości wrogowie, jak sobie wiecie. Się zgubiłem w tym kombo się ich. Jakiś taki specjalny atak pojedynczy, na, które, na który trzeba zwracać uwagę. No i tak, zaraz się już uleczymy, jeszcze mamy właśnie tą postać leczącą. Kurde, ale patrzcie jakie tysiące zadają jednak. Czyli wygląda na to, że dungeon chyba został sprawdzony w zasadzie na 100%, ale kto wie. Może przeniesiemy się na jakieś, na jakieś inne piętro. Nie, wróciliśmy się. Aha? Wait, this ain't right. How did we end up back here? So we've been here already? Yes, this is exactly where we started. But we couldn't have taken a wrong turn. We were headed in the same direction the entire time. We never turned around. Yes, that's what I thought too. Traveler, we were going the right way, weren't we? No, but I'm sure that we were going the How strange! There's a legend in Inazuma about a merchant who was tricked by a Bake Danuki one evening and kept circling around the same place the whole night. Even by dawn, they still hadn't found a way out. Yeah. Paimon's heard that one before too. So we're all familiar with the story then? Good, because I'm pretty sure that's what's happening to us right now. But fear not, I happen to have a certain sidekick who can exercise yokai and spirits and whatnot. Let me summon him real quick. Unbelievable. And only who's friends with an exorcist? Huh. What an open-minded guy. For the boss, ignorance is a virtue. You're up, Ushi. Go get that spirit. This is Ushi, an auxiliary member of the Arataki gang. Jakiegoś byka wezwał, o co chodzi? To jeszcze jak tańczy. <laughs> oh, Ushi says hello, everyone. You can just call him Ushi or Beefcake. Yeah, he's got a keen sense of direction, so I'll let him lead the way. I didn't know gangs could have auxiliary members. This does not have the trappings of something that's gonna work. <laughs> You're telling me. All right, go Ushi. Go find us a way out of here. Huh? What's that? Oh, really? Oh, no way. What's wrong? Ushi says he searched everywhere, but there's no exit. That doesn't add up. If we were able to come in, then there must be a way to get out. Here, let me take another look. Has anyone else noticed this? We initially thought we fell here from above. At that time, there was a way out high overhead. But now, it seems even that exit has disappeared. Inexplicable, if you ask me. It seems there's more than meets the eye with these underground structures. Hmm. I'm gonna take another look around. Everywhere we look, there are just more and more rocks! Uh, maybe we've just misremembered. Maybe this isn't the place we started from. What? You scared now? N no. Paimon's super brave. Oh, yeah? Well, uh, Ushi also thinks you're scared. It's okay, don't be scared to admit you're, uh, <laughs> scared. 
You've got us here to protect you. Ja obronię Paimon, no nie wiem. We can't just sit here twiddling our thumbs. Let's keep looking for a way out. Shinobu, you stay here with my precious savior. I'll take the traveler and Paimon with me. Got it. Be careful everyone. Please, there's no need to keep calling me savior. Just Yenfei is fine. Mr. Arataki, it seems that as the head of the Arataki gang, you possess a strong sense of leadership. Ah, too kind, too kind. And just call me Ito. Since we're a team now, we should have each other's backs. Uh, Paimon, if you feel scared again, I can cover your eyes for you. <sighs> Seems there's really no way out. I can't shake the feeling that there's something off about this place. Boss, did you guys find anything over there? Yes, I did. Not only that, I could have sworn I saw some shadows moving a second ago. <sighs> this place better not be haunted. Probably not the right time to ask this, but Paimon just can't help it. Ito, you're an Oni. Doesn't that kind of mean everywhere you go is haunted? No, ignore the red horns, okay? I, I'm talking about spooky, floaty ghosts. Now you see them, now you don't kind of haunted. Uh, Hito, are you afraid of ghosts? Oh no, boss, you've been found out. What? Me? <laughs> no way! What, are you kidding? <sighs> Stop choking around. <sighs> Seriously, though. Anymore. Hey, Bullchucker, if you're scared, Paimon can cover your eyes for you. Ugh. Maybe I should make better use of my time. Add a little salt and some pepper. Yeah, roasted lavender melon is delicious. You can try some when it's done. Będzie coś gotowała. All right. There are two types, sweet and savory. Which would you prefer? Mogą być oba, co jakieś melony zaczęła gotować, nie wiem, ciekawa sprawa. All right, you can try them both then. It's important that we remain calm, especially when we're in the throes of a tough situation like this. If I'm reading the situation correctly, there seems to be some secret here that the boss and I are not supposed to know about. But don't worry. I'll distract the boss while you discuss things with the others. Oh, I thought I smelled something cooking. Would you like some, Yenfei? Thank you, but I'm not hungry. You guys go ahead. Oh, and by the way, I haven't seen you in a while, Shinobu. Yeah, it has been a while, hasn't it? The last time I saw you was when you taught one of my classes as a substitute while I was studying in Liyue. Substitute teacher? Ah, yes, now I remember. It was during winter, wasn't it? Yes. I remember everyone said your lecture was very interesting. Now that I think about it, I should call you senpai. Ooh, I like the sound of that. <laughs> <sighs> Who would have ever guessed that we'd get caught up in such a dilemma together? It must be fate. Czy okazuje się, że Jan Fei również wykłada jakieś, nie wiem, na uczelni? Not only that, she's funny and engaging while she speaks. Needless to say, she's very popular among the students. <laughs> oh, I'm flattered. <sighs> I see everyone is still here. Yelon, we split into groups and searched the area, but there are no signs of any way out. How about you? Did you manage to find anything? No. And though I'd prefer not to say it, we'd better mentally prepare ourselves. If we can't find a way out, we may be stuck underground for some time. <sighs> I think you might be right. I understand. Hmm. An underground space with an entrance but no exit. It just doesn't make any sense. I'll figure something out. Just give me some time. If anyone happens to find a potential exit, please be sure to take every precaution before exploring further. Czy Ksiał również tu przybył? 
Może warto coś spróbować. Traveler, what's with the serious face? Do you have a plan? Myślę, że Xiao właśnie się też tu znajdował. Może pamiętasz? Xiao! Oh, right! Do you want to get him to help us? A czyli żeby on nam pomógł. No dobra, spróbujmy. Sure! Let's give it a shot! Możesz nas usłyszeć? No nie wiem, czy to zadziała. Co to może znaczyć? No właśnie ten Ksio coś mówił o tym miejscu, że jest niebezpieczne. Musimy ze wszystkimi porozmawiać. To jest nasze obecne zadanie, zobaczmy. Who could have ever guessed we'd get trapped in a place like this? It's quite the predicament. For all the studying I've done in my life, all I know is how to land people in prison. I don't know the first thing about breaking out of one. I've even made a contract with my father to live a happy life. I can't give up hope now. Try and stay positive. At least I've explored a new place and seen more of the world while reuniting with some old friends. <laughs> Yeah, there's still a silver lining, I guess. Właśnie, co to za wspaniała przygoda. Musimy wyszukać miejsca. To tak jak escape room. Jak to zrobić? That's it. I want to take another look. And this time, I, Arataki, the one and only, will... Boss! Whoa, whoa. What's up, sourpuss? Time for some roasted lavender melon. Huh? We're trapped in a life and death situation underground and you're telling me it's time for roasted lavender melon? <coughs> Interesting. You hear that? Ushi says you're completely right. Wait, hold on. Whose side are you on, Beefcake? <coughs> it's important to stay replenished. We must keep our energy and morale up in preparation for facing the unknown. Even Ushi knows that. Fine. You two are... Hey, are you already eating? Well, hold on. Is it still warm? Oh, oh, oh that does smell good. Hmm. Fine. Yeah, yeah. We'll, we'll we'll just we'll have a quick snack and then we'll uh, and then we'll keep looking for a way out. Hey, don't eat them all. Leave a couple for me. To nowa bohaterka, jak ona się nazywa, Shinobu, jednak e, się zna na przetrwaniu na survivalu. Może warto było ją wziąć do ekipy. Jeżeli jakoś w przyszłości będzie dodana do tych grywalnych bohaterów, no ale jeszcze zobaczymy. No jeszcze mamy tą bohaterkę, ona zapewne będzie widziała jakieś interesujące rzeczy. Może coś znalazła. Our situation is grim. There doesn't appear to be a way out for now. We should be prepared to stay for a while. Fortunately, we don't seem to lack supplies, and even our motley crew has people who can keep their cool when the stakes are high. Just focus on taking care of yourselves. I'll figure out the rest. Okay, czyli możemy wchodzić w interakcję z jakimiś tajemniczymi tabliczkami. I wtedy będziemy brali udział w jakichś walkach, tak? Nie wiem, szczerze mówiąc, nie widziałem jeszcze takich tabliczek w sumie wcześniej. Może będą jakoś nieopodal, ale teraz nic w sumie nie widać. A, czyli mamy misję Wait Till the Next Day, ok. No mamy jeszcze właśnie tą tabliczkę. Czy to jest w ogóle cokolwiek warte? A, czyli to pierwsze już w zasadzie chyba zrobiliśmy, tak? Jeszcze w przyszłości byłyby jakieś inne wyzwania. A, czyli żeby to pierwsze odblokować musimy jakieś ten... Misję wygrać, to trzeba za 13 godzin za jeden dzień, ok. Dobra, w takim razie, co my mamy zrobić, to będzie ten the time. No i czekamy, powiedzmy, jeden dzień. To powinno chyba załatwić sprawę. Taka była w sumie, taka była treść misji. Coś się zmieniło rzeczywiście. Oh, there's nothing for Paimon to do here. 
You're so boring. Oh, hope Paimon longs to stretch her legs and run free in the world outside again. Chyba latać. Oh, all right, fly free then. Basically, Paimon just wants out of here. No i tak cały dzień już minął. Just a day? No, it feels like we've been down here for months. Well, maybe not months, but at least like 20 days, surely. Yo, yo, thought I heard you chatting over here. Oh, hey, Bullchucker. Well, everyone, I just completed another survey of the surrounding area. Still nothing has changed today. Here, have some water and take a rest. Thank you, Shinobu. <sighs> it's easy to forget to keep hydrated down here. Ugh, out! I want out! All I want is to cruise the streets and have beetle fights again. Boss, remember there's your image to consider. But it's so boring. Walking around this hole every day, I, if only I could slurp some ramen and see the beautiful flowers again. Ramen? Wait a minute. Speaking of ramen, traveler, are you hungry? Jeszcze nie. I'm not hungry either. But let me pose the question this way. Who is the biggest eater among us? It's definitely not me. Hey, what's everybody looking at me for? Well, it's definitely not me. If anyone, it's this one right here. Uh, well, what are you looking at Paimon for? Paimon, are you hungry? Um, no. Paimon's not hungry. Why do you ask? To ciekawa sprawa. To może jakby się czas zatrzymał albo coś w tym stylu. Nikt nie jest głodny. <sighs> if that's the case. Huh? What, 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 what am I missing here? Paimon powiedziała, że czuć jakby to było około 20 dni. Yes, I heard that too as I was walking over. The question is, how can you not feel hungry even after 20 days? No przesadza, to był jeden dzień. That's also strange. Of course, everyone has different perceptions of the passage of time. But how could one person feel like it's only been one day and someone else 20 days? Yeah, now that you mention it, I feel like we've been here three, four, five days, but I don't feel hungry or thirsty at all. Although I cooked some food, it wasn't because I was hungry. I just wanted to keep our spirits up. I was planning on saving our rations so we could survive a few more days, but I haven't really felt hungry since. Now that I think about it, not only am I not hungry, but I don't feel any real signs of fatigue either. Whether I sleep or not doesn't seem to have any effect on how I feel. Yes, I concur. Resting doesn't make me feel more refreshed, and staying awake doesn't make me any more tired. Very peculiar. It's almost as if our physical state has been suspended. Oh, the more you say, the scarier it sounds. Paimon doesn't even want to think about it. Czy Ksiao to samo odczuwał? What's wrong, Traveler? Did you think of something? That's pretty weird. Sounds like the little dude must be in danger. But he is an Adeptus. This kind of situation should be no trouble for him. I fear that this problem underground is bigger than we thought. I found something, everyone. I just discovered a new path over there that seems to lead to an unknown area. You mean a way out? Oh, finally! Oh, you found something! Oh, please, please be the exit! I still suspect things can't be that simple. We should all stay prepared for whatever comes. Huh? Paimon doesn't see anything out of the ordinary here. Appearances can be deceiving. As I was examining the wall just now, I noticed there was something unusual about this stone. Seems to me that it's been created using some illusory magic. Hidden behind it lies a passageway. Whoa! So there really is a path behind here! Gotta hand it to ya. That sure wasn't easy to find. But at least we can finally get out of here. Uh, dziękuję, Yelan. Miss Yelan's determination and eye for detail are certainly impressive. Not to mention, you've hardly had any rest the whole time we've been trapped here. It doesn't matter. I'm not tired. 
<sighs> well, given we're already here, we might as well go in and explore. Right behind ya! Paimon can't wait to get out of this place! Czyli proszę bardzo, mamy do czynienia z tymi niewidzialnymi ścianami. No obecnie właśnie nagrywam serię z tego Elden Ring, to tam jest dosłownie na każdym kroku. Więc to jest jednak ciekawe podejście, tam trzeba w każdą ścianę uderzać, żeby być pewnym wygranej. Dobra, czyli chodźmy na kolejny portal, co tym razem nas czeka. Kolejna misja tego rodzaju. Symbole na platformach będą miały różne kolory oraz obrazki. Musimy je odpowiednio przypasować, żeby rozwiązać puzzle. Jeżeli staniemy na odpowiednim symbolu, zostanie aktywowany. A jeżeli będziemy na złym, no to dostaniemy obrażenia. No i musimy aktywować wszystkie, żeby rozwiązać puzzle. Dobra, w takim razie na czym to w ogóle może polegać? Teraz pytanie. Po pierwsze mamy jakieś pojedyncze, dziwne teleportacje. Kurde, dajcie spokój, o co w tym wszystkim chodzi? Bossy, is that you? Hey, did anyone else just hear that voice? It sounded super creepy. Co ja w zasadzie teraz doświadczam? O co z tym wszystkim chodzi? Czyli obrażenia otrzymujemy? Co ja nie mam pojęcia dlaczego. Może jakoś z tym jest związane? Będę sobie po wszystkim chodził i dostawał obrażenia. Ok, czyli to jest odpowiedni symbol. Czyli na tej ściance musi być symbol tego rodzaju. Ok. Czy są jeszcze jakieś kolejne? No w sumie te obrażenia nie są jakieś super wielkie, więc nie ma się czym przejmować aż tak bardzo. Czy jeszcze na ten środkowy musimy stanąć? A, dobra. Czyli rozwiązaliśmy jedną misję i teraz musimy zobaczyć że na kilku wrogów. Kurde, ale co to za obrażenia? Nie! Dirk mi umrze zaraz! Ej, co jest? What? A dziwna sprawa, nie mogę bohatera zmienić przez dłuższy okres. Ale dziwne. Muszę jakkolwiek jeszcze naszego zrespić, bo to inaczej nie wyjdzie. Kurde. Jakoś dziwnie mi się teraz sterowało przez chwilę, no ale dobra, zaraz powinniśmy już to rozwiązać. Musimy jeszcze jakieś leczenie wykonać, dobra, powoli jakkolwiek to wychodzi. Akurat moja Ayaka ma naprawdę bardzo dużo zdrowia, więc zaraz powinniśmy wykonać regenerację. No to niektóre ataki naprawdę bardzo dobrze mnie kontrują. Patrzcie, jakie to są obrażenia niezłe. No, trochę denerwujący wrogowie właśnie potrafią nieże uciekać. No dobra. Ok, czy jakieś powiedzmy latarnie na platformach będą świeciły na przeciwległe platformy na innej stronie? No i musimy tym odpowiednio manipulować tymi całymi latarniami, tak? Latarnie mogą być wykorzystane, żeby rzucać światło na wielkie symbole na przeciwległych platformach. No i to właśnie aktywuje te całe symbole. Aktywowanie wszystkich wielkich symboli wydaje się być rozwiązaniem tej zagadki. Okej, okay, dobra. W takim razie zróbmy jakiekolwiek manipulacje tymi laserami. Na czym to będzie teraz polegało? No jeden niby jakkolwiek rzuciliśmy, ale to chyba nie jest dobrym rozwiązaniem. A jeszcze możemy pod Q obracać. Jeszcze jest taka opcja. Zaraz, chwila, moment. A to już chyba wiem, jak, na czym to wszystko polega, tak? Dobra. Czyli to już zostało załatwione. No i teraz jeszcze ten drugi. Po raz kolejny musimy skorzystać. Aj, co jest? Coś mi w tym miejscu nie pasuje. A nie, inaczej. Czyli tak sobie obrócimy. To akurat umożliwi połączenie tych dwóch. No i teraz z tym drugim, przepraszam, pod F. 
Czyli po raz kolejny obracamy. No i chyba zagadka powinna być rozwiązana. Czyli mamy jeden klucz z czterech. No, tego może być jednak całkiem dużo. Dobra, powiedzmy, że pójdziemy sobie tym razem w tą stronę. Dobra, czyli musimy tym razem na taki oto symbol wkraczać. Nie wiem w sumie od czego te symbole zależą, prawdę mówiąc. No ale jak jeden znajdziemy, to sprawa już w sumie jest bardzo prosta. Dobra. O, i czeka nas pojedynczy pojedynek z większym bossem. No, to może być ciężki... Ciężka sprawa, całkiem ma dużo życia. Chyba, żeby Diluk mi po raz kolejny nie zginął, on wcześniej mocno obrywał. O, jeszcze ulti. Proszę bardzo. No i sprawa załatwiona. No i po raz kolejny takie samo podejście. Trzeba będzie zobaczyć, jak te jeszcze lasery ustawić, a to już raczej dosyć prosta zagadka. Dobra. No jeszcze to drugie. Jak już się rozpozna... Na czym to wszystko polega, to już jest prościzna. Chyba, że jakieś kolejne będą trochę trudniejsze, zobaczymy. Czyli na tych dwóch już mamy, jeszcze ten zobaczmy. Nie wiem, czy ten w sumie został rozwiązany. Te lasery właśnie zostały w to miejsce już sprowadzone, ale... To jeszcze nie wszystko. Jeszcze jeden symbol, zapewne tędy. Dobra. No i po raz kolejny z dwoma takimi trzeba będzie sobie poradzić. To może być dosyć ciężkie. No i zaraz zobaczymy. Czy w ogrowie posiadają czasami takie mocniejsze ataki? No dobra, całkiem dobre kombo już wjeżdżamy, więc zaraz powinniśmy chyba już zwyciężyć. Kurde, jak właśnie tak przyszpilą ci przeciwnicy, to wtedy jest to dosyć kłopotliwe. No dobra, jednego z mamy z głowy. Jest jeszcze ten drugi. No i co, po raz kolejny takie samo podejście, więc zobaczmy. Dobra, to już jest chyba proste. Tak należy na jednym zrobić, na drugim z kolei pewnie. Tak sobie skręci, będzie po robocie. Come on. Dobra. Numer 3 został załatwiony. Jeszcze ostatnia sprawa. Tędy? Chyba rzeczywiście. Czyli teraz takie podwójne A szukamy. Dobra. No i po raz kolejny. O, tym razem strza będzie sobie poradzić. To również może być dosyć ciężkim zadaniem. Zaraz zobaczymy. Jak tak wszyscy przyszpilą, no to 
To wtedy jest najbardziej kłopotliwe. O, jednego mamy zaraz z głowy. Dobra. No jeszcze jeden taki wróg. Już będzie sprawa załatwiona. No i zobaczmy jak teraz jest z tym wszystkim prai. Dobra, wydaje mi się, że na tym to będzie polegało. Dobra, i teraz to drugie. No wydaje mi się, że te odległości są raczej chyba odpowiednio wymierzone rzeczywiście. Tylko teraz pytanie, czy ja mam w tą stronę iść, gdzie są te wszystkie, gdzie ten laser się rozpoczyna, czy tam, gdzie się kończy? Nie wiem, zobaczmy tędy na wstępie. Nie, nic już nie mamy, ok. Czyli do tej dziury trzeba będzie jakkolwiek wpaść i dopiero wtedy. No, dosyć interesująca zagadka, to trzeba jednak przyznać, dawno czegoś takiego w sumie nie wiedziałem. Takiej całkowitej nowości. Dobra, więc zobaczmy. Conqueror of demons? Xiao, is that you? Uh, uh, and quit trying to scare us, okay? Huh? Wait, is this some kind of illusion? Paimon can't touch him! Conqueror of demons, can you hear us? Co ci się stało, w porządku? Hello! Little dude! Anyone home? He isn't responding. What's going on here? You... Oh, he finally said something! Oh! We followed your voice and found you here, but it's kind of strange. We can't touch you. How did you become an illusion? <sighs> an illusion? Talk about a coincidence. We were just thinking you went missing and stuff, and then we heard the sound of you fighting. Pretty lucky we found you, if you ask me. <laughs> you didn't get hurt, did you? A coincidence. Wait. Something's not right. <coughs> Something's wrong with this domain. Leave now. Get out of there. Co się dzieje? Czy wszystko w porządku? If he can, we should have him regroup with us as soon as possible. Tell us what happened and where you are now. We'll come find you immediately. No. Your safety is the top priority. It seems this space can He disappeared. Where'd he go? It sounded like he might be injured. We need to go help him. It seems the only option we have to explore any further is through that entrance over there. Huh. He's injured and telling us to be careful? It's not like we're in any danger here. Anyway, the secret behind whatever's going on should be in this cave, right? Don't worry, little dude. Ito's on the way. Boss, please don't go charging ahead. You're an Oni, not some hunting dog. Don't worry, I'm invincible! Ah! Oh, my butt! <sighs> Looks pretty deep. Be careful, everyone. O kurde! Dobra. Gdzie my teraz żeśmy przybyli, czyli gramy jako główny bohater i nagle się okazuje Nie możemy innymi sterować Well, 
one is tough! Go ahead, you can cry if it hurts. I promise I'll try not to laugh. What? What do you mean, try not to laugh? You should be feeling some serious sympathy for me right now. But wouldn't feeling sorry for you be a violation of your dignity? Besides, it's harder not to laugh when I'm not the one in pain. <laughs> O co chodzi w ogóle? Palcem go dotknęła? Paimon, don't laugh. It's okay, everybody. If you want to laugh at him, just let it out. Don't you have a heart, Shinobu? Oh, and people think I'm the monster. Wait a second. Show's not here, but. That's the Zajvi. Seems a little out of place here, don't you think? Maybe it's some sort of, uh, I don't know, an emergency shelter? There was a picture book I read once that said nice people sometimes build cabins in dangerous places so that anyone in trouble can take shelter inside. Our little dude must be inside then. Yeah! I wouldn't be too sure about that. Any person with a normal sense of danger wouldn't be so optimistic. Wow, bold checker. Looks like your subordinate is telling you what's what. Oh, I believe she was talking to both of us. Yeah, so you can wipe that smug smile off your face. All right, watch and learn, Shinobu. This is why I'm the boss and you're the deputy. If no one is macho enough to open the door, then allow me. Step aside. Once this door is open, we are out of here. No i co? Udało mu się, nie ma się z czego śmiać. Evaloni, be gone! You heard me! Get out of here! Uh, am I seeing things? Or was there someone behind the door? Nah, can't be. You're just saying things. Why don't we just open the door again and see? Who? Uh, me? Oh, uh, all right, uh, I'll open it again. All you do is goof around all day. You're a bad influence to our child. Be gone! <laughs> Those people are carrying bowls. Bowls full of beans. What's that all about? People throw beans to drive out Oni. Boss is an Oni, so they throw beans at him to get rid of him. Gave me the fright of my life! What are people from Inazuma doing in a place like this anyway? <laughs> Calm down now. You're a person from Inazuma too, you know. Hey, let's get one thing straight, alright? I'm not a person, I'm an Oni! Right, but that's not the point. The question is, does this door lead to Inazuma? Huh? How could that be possible? Oh, this place is so weird. Paimon's starting to think it really is haunted. Otwórzmy po raz kolejny i zobaczymy, czy coś się zmieniło. You guys go right ahead. I'm not opening it again. So, who's up? Oh, how about Paimon? Why don't you open it? No way! Somebody else do it. Paimon's scared. All right, I'll try. That's our Shinobu! Now, don't let whoever's behind that door push you around, okay? All right. Let's see what's behind the door this time. Still reading, Shinobu. Listen, young lady. You should keep your nose out of those books and start taking my advice. I've already found you a perfectly good job as a shrine maiden at the Grand Narukami Shrine. You'll be far better off there than... <laughs> uh, Shinobu? Who is that? No way! Was that who I think it was? Well, this is embarrassing. 
that voice was my mother. This is one place I wasn't counting on having to hear that speech again. Your mother wanted you to become a Shrine Maiden? The whole reason I came to study in Liyue was because I didn't want to become a Shrine Maiden. My family never approved of my studies, so they wanted me to work in the Grand Narukami Shrine after I returned to Inazuma. From what we know about Lady Guji, it seems being a Shrine Maiden is a pretty cushy job. Think of it this way. Some cats can be domesticated and kept in the house, while other cats are meant to survive in the wild. As for me, I need complete freedom and space. Although I do admit that being a Shrine Maiden is a decent job, it's just not for me. That's right, your calling is with the gang. I mean, just look at you! You rock! You're totally hardcore! Come on, am I the only one with chills right now? It's true. You've got a good thing going. What's most important is that you enjoy what you do. Gotta agree with you there. From the look of it, what's behind the door can change. And not only that, it always changes to something that nobody wants to see. So, uh, how are we gonna get through that? And don't forget, we have that little dude waiting for us to save him. We need to get our rear in gear. Would any of you like to give it a try? Mm, no thanks. I'd prefer not to open it if only something terrible awaits. If anyone's going to find a way through, it's not going to be me. Uh, why? Because I don't buy it, that's why. I don't believe for one second that we're gonna find the Conqueror of Demons by going through that door. So I'm sure as heck not gonna be the one to get us through. Not gonna lie, uh, you don't really sound like you have much of an imagination. All right, I'll try. Yeah, my savior. Show him what you're made of. Czy masz jakieś fobie, Janfei? I'm sure I probably do, but nothing springs to mind right now. Anyway, I suppose I'll find out once I open the door. You old geezer. Out of eight pounds of salt, today you gave away three for free, sold two, and exchanged three for booze. How much money did you actually make in the end? Huh? But didn't you tell me to sell things as I pleased? Why can't I give the customers something for free? You fool! You told the old man next door to come and fetch the salt. Well, he broke his leg on the way over, and now his son is asking for compensation. Seriously. <sighs> huh. A civil dispute. Didn't see that coming. Who are they? <sighs> no one in particular, but it is a prime example of the many difficult civil cases that I've had trouble handling before. Hmm. So you mean you don't like handling disputes over petty matters? Not exactly. What I mean is that I don't like working with people who cannot let go of trivial grievances, especially of the kind you saw just now. They start with good intentions, but end up making a big fuss. It's not long before those good intentions plunge into injury and accidents. <sighs> it's always a shame. It's my desire to solve problems for people. That's why I became a legal advisor. It just seems that I still can't fully comprehend the complicated minds of some people. <sighs> I understand what you mean. The human mind is probably both the most complicated and tragic of things. I suppose there is no need to discuss this any further. <laughs> Does anyone else want to try the door? Don't look at me. I told you, I'm not taking a chance with that thing. Come on, Yelan. We're a team here. If you're not gonna try, then at least give us a convincing reason why. <sighs> In that case, let me be perfectly clear. I serve Ningguang, the Tianxuan of the Qixing. The scope of my work includes some of Liyue's biggest secrets. The chances are, if I open this door, there can be no witnesses left alive. Is that a sufficient reason for you? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, sounds, sounds impressive. Um, hey, Shinobu, uh, who's Ningguang? She's someone who won't let you walk out of the chasm alive if she finds out that you're prying into her secrets. Boss, you really do need to work on learning who's who in the world these days. Look, I knows what I needs to knows. It's called being a free Oni. Oh, now Paimon gets it! Yelan works for Ningguang! <laughs> yes, which is precisely why I was trying to keep her secret. <laughs> we should avoid letting Yelan open this door. What about you, Traveler? Would you like to try? 
Yeah, go for it, Traveler. Besides, you never know who could be behind that door. Maybe it could even be Shell. I say give it a shot. Who knows? Maybe little dude is waiting for us on the other side. Dobra. Może tą siostrę znajdziemy, to by było interesujące. Tak bym stawiał. So, wait. What's Paimon looking at? Abyss? Ten inny wymiar? Do tego się obawiałem. Coś próbuje mnie uwięzić. O co w ogóle chodzi w tym miejscu? O, mamy jakiś... Jakieś miejsce? A, czyli wróciłem. O co chodzi w ogóle? Dobra, zaraz, chwila, moment, bo jeszcze się bohater zabugował. A dziwna sprawa. Did you find anything, Traveler? So, did you find the person we want to rescue inside? Nie, to dziwna sprawa. Jak się w ogóle teleportowaliśmy jeszcze? Judging by the look on your face, I'm guessing you saw something a little unpleasant in there. No powiedzmy. No widziałem ten inny wymiar. Ciemność abyss. So let me get this straight. Not only did we not find Shao through that door, we saw all the things that we wish to avoid. I'm starting to have a very ominous feeling about this domain. It's constantly changing, and its changes seem to be targeted at us. Huh? What do you mean? I feel the same way. We need to watch our every step. There is definitely more to this place than meets the eye. I concur. We came here following the Conqueror of Demons, but we ended up only finding a strange door. The things we've encountered on the other side of that door are equally strange. It shows us whatever we fear the most. We're in a space that defies common logic. <sighs> on top of that, I'm starting to feel tired after that experience. But I thought we'd established that getting tired doesn't happen down here. The phenomenon hasn't reached a lethal stage just yet. Otherwise, we would have starved to death without eating for so long. I'm starting to worry that we're being affected by the changes in this space. In order to avoid the sudden accumulation of hunger and fatigue, we should eat and rest regularly from now on. To my sense. <sighs> Paimon suddenly feels exhausted. It's really tiring going through all this. Now that you mention it, I'm starting to feel tired too. No, 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 it's all just an illusion. I will not let my mind play tricks on me. Oh, Paimon's whole body just feels so heavy now. Hmm. According to the current evidence, it seems our physical condition was suspended in this space before, which granted us immunity to the effects of fatigue and hunger. And now it seems that mental fatigue is unavoidable. Though we have yet to locate the Conqueror of Demons, I suggest we go back and get some rest. It'll be difficult to rescue anyone if we're on the verge of collapse ourselves. She's right. Hey, Lavender Melon. You okay? Want me to carry you?
Czyli wróciliśmy się na sam początek? A, czyli po raz kolejny musimy porozmawiać ze wszystkimi chwila, moment, gdzie oni się w ogóle teraz znajdują trochę dalej. A, czyli rzeczywiście się wróciliśmy, nie wiem, w zasadzie w jakiś sposób, bo to było dosyć ciężkim zadaniem, nie wiem. Dobra, w każdym razie w tym miejscu raczej zakończę dzisiejszy materiał, to już trwa z jakąś godzinę, więc więcej teraz nie nagram. Ale jeżeli interesuje Was kontynuacja, to polecam zostawić lajka, suba, dzwonka po kolejne codziennie wychodzące materiały. Więc tak, więc to było na tyle, ja się z żegnam, no i do jutra!